Hey, Mark from here, Got Suffering here at Free Online Trading Education.com, brought to you by Brock Trade, where I'm an analyst, host of the Brock Star Trading Room, and perhaps your future mentor. All right, our trade today is on CROX Crux. Here's what it was in late morning. It had done some high bases here and a high base here, and now it was pinching right there. You can call this a symmetrical triangle. You can also call it a bull pennant, and it's the end of a run up, and so it's a little more bullish than it is bearish. If you want to know more about it, go to our free chart school at freeonlinetradingeducation.com. Right here is a free chart school. Go to symmetrical triangle. Here's a description of it, and here is a picture of it where it's getting tighter and tighter on lower volume and kaboom if it comes out of there it can explode especially if there's added volume all right let's take a look and see what happened next it's going and boom there it goes it did pop out and look at the volume the volume increased on that and I got in at fifteen dollars and sixty seven cents I am long and it started can to go let's see what happened after that it went up and look at that it went all the way up here to 1585 boom 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 and it was way up here way a long ways away from that 8 EMA that's over 1% so what I did was I took my stop and I as this candle closed I put my stop just underneath that uh, because it, if I use the 8 EMA as I normally do that would have left too much at risk or too much exposure of, of my um, now I'm I have a guaranteed winning trade here because I have zero risk in it, but I'm trying to protect some of my profits, and it's still going. It's still so right here is my stop, and it's still holding. It's still holding. Let's see what happened after that. Bam! It fell down, and it broke all the way through the 8 EMA, and is back down here to the 20. So I'm glad that I protected my profits and got in there, out at $15.75 for 0.5 percent in just four minutes. So that's how I manage my stop when it gets overextended like that away from the 8 EMA, which is very tight stop to hold anyway. See back on this run here, it ran up real tight to it. This one got way overextended. That's the reason that I stopped using that as my placement for my stop and started putting it underneath the bottom of each of these closed candles. Well, that's the kind of trades we're doing in the Grok Star Room, and I hope you've had a wonderful year in 2013. My last video for the year, and just want to keep saying, trade safe and trade well. <laughs>